see if that does anything positive for me. Hashtag positivity. Stay positive, everybody. Today we're gonna be going random character. We got melting. That is probably the worst outcome that we could have gotten. And by the way, I'm using the nuclear throne together mod, which is why I'm glowing purple. Um, yeah. But I have no friends to play it with, but I keep it installed just in case a friend shows up. Doubtful. Doubtful that I'll ever get any friends. Hashtag positivity, everybody. I'm really staying positive with these positive comments. So I grabbed plutonium hunger. By the way, I'm like, I just woke up and I'm getting, I'm, I'm drinking stuff. So, you know, don't like think that I'm not drinking stuff because that's kind of an, an astute judgment. I, I say that we shouldn't judge people based on whether they're drinking things or not. But yeah, plutonium hunger is going to be really good, man. Because, oh, trigger fingers. Basically, plutonium hunger is going to attract stuff. means we don't have to, like, get out into the fray to pick ammo stuff up as much into the fray. Then we got trigger fingers, which is really, really good. I, I have a feeling that we're going to embarrassingly die on Big Bandit. So, no, okay. I'm kind of not even paying that much attention. Yeah, let's go, let's go wrench. Let's hope that we can get a scarier face as our next mutation. Oh, oh. We got thrown bolt, which is really, really good as melting. It means that, um, basically, when you right click, each corpse does three explosions instead of just one. That's so good. I, would, I, I can't really call it OP, because I mean, well, I can, I just don't want to, because it's going to make someone salty. Also, apparently, these, this, this one shots rats now, I don't remember that being a thing. Did they nerf rats or some shit? Pardon my French. We got a lovely 101 kills. So it's actually a really nice number because I know if you guys have ever heard of the show 101 Dalmatians, but yeah, it reminds me of that. We need to get into the habit of right clicking because I haven't been doing a whole bunch of that recently, have I? Also, these explosions can blow up enemy bullets, which is incredibly useful. Um, oh, oh, oh boy. Incredibly useful. You know, because you, let's say you're being shot at by a bad, bad person. Just right click. All your pains go away. Oh, there's still a boy there. There's a boy coming! Oh god, this is awkward. I never meant to say there's a boy coming. And now I'm gonna get, like, banned. Well, let's bl I wanna blow this up because I'm angry and I need to let off some steam. I never wanted to let you go. I don't know why I just saying that, but I feel like I don't have enough like filler stuff to say. Like I need some sort of catchphrase, like "Oh shucks," you know, just something. Oh well, that was close. Oh, now the police are here. Just like my wedding, you know, this is exactly how my first date went. Auto crossbow, damn son. Oh, this guy's gonna be annoying. Whatever. We got him. Um, and we're in the crown vault now. We got strong spirit. So good. That is so good, man. 
I don't want a crown. What are you? What are you crazy? I'm gonna watch the fucking Republican National Convention with you, you fucking weeaboos. Okay. Okay. I like missing every shot. No, that's fine. You know who's a cool guy? Julian Casablancas. Is that yeah how you say it? But yeah, he's a cool guy. I would recommend him. If you're ever looking for sub like a scapegoat for coolness, like a reverse scapegoat, like a an example of human intelligence, I think that Julian Casablancas Casablancas is you know the way of the future. I forgot to right click. Like I keep forgetting to right click. There's no reason to play melting if I'm not gonna right click. And we got long arms. Interesting. Okay, this is scary. Oh wow, this one shots them. Ah! Jesus. Okay, this that was incredibly scary. And I hope that I never have to go through that again. It's like childbirth. Fuck man, there's so many boys in this in this hood. I don't know if you've ever watched Cory in the house, but imagine that. That's how this house is about to be empty with the boy in it called Cory. My name's not Cory, by the way, in case you were wondering. Mm. Laser brain. Laser brain's really good. Now now the screwdriver is gonna hit twice. Because it what laser brain does to uh energy melee weapons is that it makes them stay up for twice as long. So like the it it stays up for like two damage ticks, so it can damage an enemy twice in one swing. That's really good, that's fucking double the damage, dude. You're know, paying attention, that's double the damage! Oh, plasma gun. Don't like it. I don't like it. I feel like if I use the plasma gun once, like, thousands of people are gonna just complain if I don't pick it up again in another episode, because you're like, it's like, oh man, I, th I thought you were a big plasma gun fan. Yeah, man, I forgot that as soon as I picked up the fucking plasma gun, I signed, like, a, a waiver saying that I cannot pick up any other weapon, and I'm not married to the plasma gun. Thanks for asking. It's kind of a fun run. It's not a one run, but it's a fun run. That was probably the cringiest thing I've ever done. And that's kind of a big accomplishment if you've ever watched any of my videos. I'm kind of like the cringe lord. Also, you know what's funny? I, um, I haven't been hit once. Like, at all. That's kind of cool. I th I'm kind of proud of myself for that. So, yeah... This is kind of, I, I feel like I'm going to get hit on Little Hunter. Oh, as soon as I said that I hadn't get hit, I shouldn't have jinxed it, really. Oh, yeah, I keep forgetting to right-click yet again. Oh, my God. Fuck, man. That was a really good run. And then I got a bit cocky at the end. So let's, let's try that again. Let's do eyes, man. Eyes is a good lad. Let's try and like go quick here because I don't want to like have an hour long video. But I don't know how long that other run was. Yeah, yeah, I'm not doing well. This is not how you go quick, this is how you die quick. I'm not going quick at all. 
Oh, look at this, like, perfectly, like, rectangular hallway. Rectangulus. That sounds like a really, 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 really good name for, like, a square-shaped supervillain. Well, not square-shaped, but, like, geometry-based. Like, he summons shapes. Summons. Summon. I don't know how to pronounce things. I am not a smart. And, and yeah, and then Batman's like, Rectangulus, you killed John Michael Caine. And then, right, and then Batman's, and then Rectangulus is like, You're fucking right, mate, I did do that. Now let me turn you into a triangle. Let me morph into a triangle. And then I would be happy because I don't know if you're aware, but I think a lot of people's dreams is to be a shape. And I'm not talking about like the type of biscuit, like the shape, shapes like crackers. They're not actually crackers, they're just sort of savory biscuits, but. Um, yeah, I don't know where I was going, I kind of lost track there with the shit, but Biscuits rant. You know, I'm sick of Leafy making a fucking rant video every two days. I think he's just figured out that he can make thousands of dollars by picking on, like, people who everybody already hates. Like... Yeah, everybody already fucking hates Onision, let's make a video about him. And then all of his younger fans who, like, don't know anything about Onision are like, Wow, this guy doesn't seem like a very nice dude at all. Leafy, if you're watching this random child play a game that you don't even like, with, like, ten subscribers, then, dude... Dude. Yo, but the fan. <gasps> yes. We need to have a, a rectangus. Tangulus. Rectangulus and cube crossover episode. If you don't know, Cube is the most innovative platformer you'd have played in years. And so we need to have a crossover between it. And the the new uh, Marvel superhero Rectangulus, who is also coincidentally a part of the Batman universe. I don't know; it doesn't make much sense. But neither does a man whose name is Rectangulus. I mean, Rectangulus. Does that sound like the sort of name a sane her person would have? He killed Michael Caine. See, we're already, like, getting into the details of Rectangulus's, like, story here. We can even write, we could probably, like, write a book as well called The Rectangular Story. It'll have, like, 500 pages of stuff about Rectangulus. Rectangulus is, you know, he's a smart man. He knows all about shapes. He, ne he never, ever skipped, like, a trigonometry lesson. He knows Pythagoras. Yeah, and he, and he can have a sidekick called Trigonometrina. That was a fucking terrible joke. But, you know, we have to keep in the theme of terrible jokes, because Rectangulus is also a terrible joke. Feels only fitting that his sidekick would be also a terrible, terrible joke. You know, we need to make up a like a backstory. Like, we need to further the uh, rectangular universe. You know, let's call it the extended universe of rectangular. It's gonna be a 200-page comic about rectangular. 
That's a laser rifle. That's a flame shotgun. Okay, so here's my idea. First of all, rectangulus. was born in Mexico. Now I know what you're thinking, but Joel, Mexico doesn't have that good of an education system to teach students about trigonometry, and, I'm, and my response is, you fucking racist. That is the most cyberbully thing I've heard in years. You are a cyberbully. And another thing, Mexico, you need to know about shapes, because Mexico is a shape. That was, a f that was also a terrible joke. But yet again, I will say that it fits in the theme of terrible jokes. Okay. You know what? On me. Yeah, I just woke up. You know, this is kind of fun talking about our beloved. I feel like Rectangulus would is the sort of name that a person who started a nuclear war without anybody realizing would have. Like, that's just kind of seems like a random thought, but you need to think of it from the perspective of somebody who has been in a nuclear war. Okay? What name would you have if you had started a nuclear war? Jeffrey? No, nah, man. Not Jeffrey. What are you, crazy? You think just any random Jeff off the street can, like, start a nuclear war? Nah. It's gotta be Rectangulus or, you know, uh, Kim Jong-un, you know? Obama. Yeah, you have to have a like a very unique resonant name, something that just snaps at you. But yeah, Rectangulus was born in Mexico, and then at the age of eleven, learned all about his favorite shapes. He then started a nuclear war at the age of twelve. I think twelve is a good age to start a nuclear war. Because I think that's when you start, like, becoming evil. Like, if if you're a supervillain, that's where they start, like, developing their evil traits. Um. And. Yeah. He then met Trigonometrina. No. Tr Trina is a bad name. It needs to be some other... Trigonometristan. See, that's a that's a lot more resonant. <laughs> resonant evil. Haha. <laughs> and uh, I'll bounce a shotgun. And then, at age twenty-two, this was in nineteen thirty-eight, moved to America to enlist into World War Two. Even though, I don't know, I'm not good with dates, but I think it hadn't started yet. Yeah, it started in 1939, I think. So he was like a seer as well. His knowledge of shapes gave him a very good knowledge of a crystal ball. Oh crap, I forgot about Little Hunter. Life is bad, but death's all wrong. Oh, little hunter, what you gotta do? What you gonna do when I laser you? Is this it? Is this where I die? I live. This is where I live. Are oh, you gonna try and grenade me, kid? So, yeah. And then, but, but the thing is, he couldn't join the World War II because he was unfit. And they were like, nah, man, you're fucking unfit. Like, we don't have anything to do with you because your entire knowledge of shapes is sh fucking 
not suitable for shooting Nazis, right? And so, then they made the great decision of instead they enlisted him into scientists they like they noticed his ability to recognize oh that's so good and we have long arms okay um we just need a laser brain oh i've been hit so they put him on like a team of scientists right and they were like, hey man, if you're so good at shapes, why you recognize this shape, fucker? They put up like an impossible shape, has infinite sides, I mean, that's just called a circle, but yeah. And so he was like, that's a circle. And then they were like, oh damn, we've been beaten by the best. And so... That is how he got enlisted into the army. He wasn't enlisted into the army, he was a scientist. Sorry, he, was, he wasn't enlisted in the army. He was too weak. And then, here's the thing, right? He was so good at shapes that he was top of his the scientist, like, shape division. Right, and so they were like, oh, Rectangulus, can you please do, do us a favor? And Rectangulus was like, yes, my disciple, my disciple, I am the great Rectangulus, what do you desire of me? And then, oh, we're in the palace. They were like, hey, can you make us... A headset, an implant that can control, get this, control shapes. And Rectangulus was like, oh fucking oath mate, I made that when I was 12, you stupid cunts. And then he was like, oh wow, Rectangulus, why are you so cruel? And then Rectangulus was like, just joking, just having a bit of a giggle, mate. Then pulled pulled out like a box of his childhood toys. Then right there was the shape shifting machine, literally shape shifting, because you're not actually like shifting yourself. Oh fuck, you're not actually shifting yourself. You're actually shifting like these guys suck. I hate them so much, and all my weapons are like close range. Oh god, that hit me. I don't like this dog. So yeah, and so he shifts like shapes and stuff. Changes shapes. And then, a few years later, he like meets Batman. You know, just normal stuff. Oh, oh. I thought we were on the throne already, but I was wrong. Ah! Uh, no! <gasps> you fucker. This is the scariest thing I've done in this video game. The heavy revolver sucks, but I'm gonna use it. Let me out of this. Let me out of this eternal hell with dogs in it. Okay. I don't know how I managed to survive that, but if we get, if this last guy drops a health pack, then we're set, pretty much, because we'll have strong spirit, but no, he didn't. Now we're fighting the throne. The shovel sucks compared to the laser energy sword. 
Hey guys, welcome to Minecraft. And then, Rectangulus fights Batman, even though he's a Marvel villain. Cause that makes sense. Well, this is gonna be kinda awkward, cause we have to like shoot these things with this weapon that isn't that good. Pardon me. I'd really like to have a weapon that is good. And I have to kind of click a lot with this weapon. Yes, shoot your balls at me. That'll give me some lovely ammunition. Yay. Balls have been shot out of the air. That's a lot of balls. You, th you may have taken it a bit too far, I don't want this many balls. But I appreciate your concern. I appreciate what you're trying to do. Okay, now we just shoot the boy because he's angry at us. Because we killed his generators, that gives him like a anger plus 50 anger points buff. I, I guess I just keep clicking, because, I mean, that seems to be what's working. I wish I had something that wasn't so clicky. It's gonna give me, like, repetitive strain injury. It's gonna be give me, like, carpal tunnel. But I'm at the point where I don't care. I just, I just need that loop. Please. Please, just, I don't care if I... If you give me the carpal tunnel, just please let me loop. I did it. And we got trigger fingers. I didn't even realize that we didn't have that. So, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean. I mean, it can't have been doing, can't do much for us if I didn't realize that we didn't have it. Right? I mean, it's absence can't be that missed if I don't realize that it is absent. I hate these. I don't understand. I wish I had a better weapon. I th the more I say it, the more I realize that saying it isn't gonna, like, give me a better weapon. Whoa! Yow! Why am I not getting bullets? It's kind of weird. Dude, dude, just die, please. It's just awkward for the both of us. Come on. Dude, come on, trust me. Just, please, just die. Thanks. I'm on full health anyway. I'm trying to think what I want as our, as our ultra, but I'm kind of thinking that I don't want the ultra. Like, I'm kind of like feeling as if, mm, feeling as if that we don't need it. It's gonna do nothing, really. Either of them. Oh, hey, it's the police. Whoop, whoop. That's the sound of the police. I just took a lot of damage from, like, stupid, stupid enemies. But I guess that's the point of looping. I mean... Oh, come on! Could you have picked a worse hallway? That boy is... Wow! Thanks for watching, everyone. I hope you enjoyed my uh, rectangulus rant. Hashtag subscribe today for more rectangulus. This is now a rectangulus channel. Every single video from now on will be rectangulus. Thank you for watching. Hashtag rectangulus lives on.